an industry that has been dealt several challenges over the past two years from navigating the pandemic to limiting alcohol only to those party buses that are fully enclosed. News Channel 5's Araceli Crescencio tells us the nice weather we've had this week is causing new problems for transportainment. On a Friday night in Nashville, you see a lot of this. Much like the Batman building, party buses have become a staple in the city. But as the weather gets warmer, these people didn't sign up for a 90 degree tour. Frustrations have reached a boiling point for Patrick Kludak. You're really kicking a family in the teeth right now when you go ahead and put these type of restrictions when there's nothing, nothing, not one thing that was never not safe about our bus. Kludak is the co-owner of Upstage Party Bus. He says the restrictions that went into effect last year in the winter are now posing a safety risk with 70 degree weather. It's not safe for my driver. It's not safe for, uh, for my bartender and DJ. It is not fun for the people that are inside. He says having to be completely enclosed means heat gets trapped inside, making it feel like 90 degrees. It is so warm in there, but I mean, we're having fun. It would be nice if the um, roof was able to be removed because Man, I can tell you, if you get a bunch of people on that, you would be sweating huge. Already, Kludex lost customers. On my 1.30 trip today, they got on. They were completely excited, have, like they were ready to have a good time. They got on, um, and right from the beginning, they were just like, it is way too hot in here, and I had to refund them. He says he's done everything he can to make it cooler, spending thousands of dollars on fans, but even that hasn't worked. We installed these six fans, and that AC unit right back there. And still, I mean, it is, it's warm in here. Now he's pleading and calling on council members to make some changes soon. Let's go ahead and do what is right from a health perspective and get back to being Nashville. In Nashville, Araceli Crescencio, News Channel 5.